CEO of Dangote Group, Oliko Dangote, there. Now, let's talk party politics. The minister of the FCT, Nyesom Wiki, during the weekend sent a warning to governors to stay clear and avoid interference in the affairs of the People's Democratic Party in River State. The former governor spoke at the party's state congress. He also mentioned that despite the political situation in River State, nobody can take the party away from the people. At the event, party delegates elected Chukwe Meka Aaron as chairman of the party. The Congress held at the PDP Secretariat in Port Harcourt amid the division in the party between members loyal to Governor Siminalai Fubara and the Minister of the Federal Capital Territory, Inyesamwike. They said that we are finished. They are finished. Anywhere you see them said they are finished. And let me assure all of you, not while we live, not while we live, anybody will take away the structure of PDP from us. Not while we live. And let me tell people, I hear that there are some governors, I hear there are some governors who say they will take away the structure and give back to somebody. I pity those governors. area in River State. Chidi Lloyd joins me on the program from Port Harcourt, River State. Also joining us is former state organizing secretary of the PDP in Lagos State, Liki Oshikoya. Gentlemen, thank you so much for joining us on the program today. I'll begin with you, Mr. Lloyd. The statement by Yinsom Wiki that he will put fire in the state of PDP governors. Do you agree that that statement was provocative? Put fire in the state of being dumped. Do you agree that that statement was provocative? Well, thank you very much for the question. Uh, Do you agree? Thank you very much for the question. Uh, I'll tell you emphatically that I do not agree that the statement was provocative. Uh, the statement was made within a milieu. It was made within a contest. Uh, so it wasn't made out of from. The, it wasn't made out of the blues. What was he saying? He said, "Look, I hear some governors say they will take the structure and give to a certain person, and he just told you that the PDP is a party that is, is a is, is a party that runs a constitutional democracy." Uh, nowhere in our constitution do you take structures and hand over to people. No. What happens is that when congresses are, 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 are contested, congresses are contested, the national uh, secretary sends people uh, to come and conduct congresses as well as uh, by form, declare for the positions which they want to run for. And when the, the votes are cast, winners emerge. So when you go through the process, nobody has capacity to take the party structure and hand over to someone who probably was not ready uh, for the work. So that's what the minister referred to. Uh, and when he said he will put fire, it is uh, an allegory. Uh, he didn't mean that he will go to those states and set fire on those, in those states, no. What he's saying is that if you interfere with my states, I also have the capacity uh, to interfere with your state. Recall that he came second in the very well contested uh, uh, presidential primaries. So he has the structures across the across the federation. That is what he's trying to tell tell them that he can commence political crisis for them too, so that they will see what it is in River State. And when people make the type of state, you know, I, I do not blame those who try to uh, uh, you know, make a mountain out of Mohi. Because everybody is uh, analyzing from the point of view where he or she stands. Uh, my, my principal did not uh, say anything that will warrant this kind of discourse all week long. All right. We are saying that 
We didn't see those governors in River State during the build-up to the 2023 elections. Neither did they purchase from for the governor of River State. Neither did they join us in the campaigns any day across the 23 local government areas. So you cannot, you cannot now come uh, to begin to uh, determine what should happen in our state. No. All right, we Mr. Will Lloyd. That's what the minister has said. I hear you, Mr. Lloyd. And uh, may I just mention also that you should try uh, switch off your TV set so that there is no delay in hearing the question and responding to them in good time. Uh, let me come to you, Mr. Oshikoya. Uh, where exactly has Nyesamwike gone wrong in his stance that power must return to the South? Because, uh, you know, that uh, seems to always have been his growls. Mr. Shikoya, please. I want to, uh, good evening, and I want to thank you for having me. First and foremost, Mr. Witte got it wrong that he would put fire in all states. But if you allow me to please, to please mention that, I will tell you that he does not have the capacity, he does not have the strength. And the, and the belief is, is a delusion that he thinks he has power in the 36 state. He only has his power in local government in River State. We have over, overrated with it. And as far as I'm concerned, there are people, be, there have been governors before with it, and there will be governor after with it. So if he has lost in his state, I think the best thing is for him to see how he will reconcile with his governor. And he's not the first person that has left the party. But he has not done the honorable thing by saying, look, I am not in this party. He wants to be in and out. In and out in the sense that he wants to be in the, gov in the government of APC and destroying PDP. And that is what Wike is doing. And if the, if the leadership of the PDP, I have, kept, I have said it severally, that the leadership is weak. If the leadership is strong, by now Wike should be out of PDP. And I think that is the, the, the right thing to do. They should tell him the truth to his face. Yes, he has a, a big check. He has money. He has everything to go around. But look, if we need a strong opposition in this country, if we want the country to move forward, then Wike should be out of PDP. They should show him the way out of PDP. Yes, he contested. He was, when he contested for the, the presidential election, he lost the election. And he said, whoever wins, if you remember very well. So irrespective of the, who the winner comes from, South or not, he gave his word, and I thought he should be a man of his word, but Wike is not a man of his word. You will see him say something today, and tomorrow he will say another thing. But for him to say he would put fire in all other states, he, he does not have such power. And I'm, I'm, I'm sure he's joking. And believe me, he's just saying it because there are people with him, so that they will hail him, and that was what they did. After that, nothing. He, can, he does not have that capacity. He does not have it. And I say he does not have it because I know he does not have it. Well, let's get reaction from Mr. Lloyd. You have heard Mr. Shiko 